Hi, welcome back. I'm Donna from Donna's Quilt Studio and today I'm going to show you some more free motion quilting. Hopefully you've had a chance to look at some of my previous demonstrations and you'll notice that we've done a lot of curved designs, spirals, that sort of thing. So today we're going to look at something a little bit different and we're going to be doing some square shaped spirals. As you can see from the design, it's basically the same as the round spirals, but we're just going to get it into a more of a square shape. I've started by making a couple of parallel lines. Um, if you're working within a border or a sashing, you will have those lines in place, and that width will determine how big you're going to be doing your square. We start in the centre, and we're going to move over to the right, working clockwise around, working about a quarter of an inch all the way into the centre. Work to your corner point and down, take it down about as wide as the square is going to be. Now just travelling into the centre, when you get into the centre what we're going to do is we're going to go towards you till about a quarter of an inch past that square spiral that you've done and then we're going to start again. So just remember that you need to keep these square so in your mind work from point point to point to point just keep thinking that as you go round that will ensure that it doesn't get too round right into the center and then straight out over to the right down and off we start again This simple and effective design can be worked very easily along borders and sashings. Remember you can vary the size and also the size between the lines, it's totally up to you. I hope this has given you some more ideas on how to use simple designs to great effect. Good luck and I'll see you again soon.